Okay, it's beer o'clock on real little craft beer. We are in Poland today and with Zemek of Bro Pinter. Hi. How are you doing? Fine, um, thank you. We're brewing a collaboration today. What, yeah. what are we going to brew? We are brewing an uh, Imperial uh, Irish Red Ale. Brilliant. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and it will be uh, the deep red, uh, well hopped uh, with a rich aroma, uh, the stronger version of a classic uh, red Irish Ale. And of course that red colour comes from the malt. And as you can see behind, if we could just get the camera in over the malt going down there into the mash tun. What malt are we using today? Uh, the basic malt is the pale ale. Yeah. And uh, other malts are uh, melanoidium malt okay. for the color, cadaret. Yeah. For the color. And uh, caramel malt, caramelish. And uh, roy malt. Fantastic. Oh, yeah. There's some rye going in it as well, so a nice kind of spicy kind of taste we want yeah. with the beer as well with that, with that nice hot bang. Um, if I could just take the camera, I want to say a quick hello to Thomas Kuiper. Uh, hello guys. Thomas, how are you doing? I'm, I'm recording it too for my uh, video blog in Polish, so, so we, we are going to record it on a two, two cameras, so uh, I'm really excited. We have been uh, uh, yesterday at the late night, uh, we've been uh, taking some... Uh, some um, <coughs> Um, we spent the night drinking samples, didn't we? Yeah, drinking samples <laughs> and thinking about a recipe and... and, and uh, fantastic, fantastic. Is there anything you'd like to add at this stage with the malts going in? No. Oh, so no. basically the malt here, if you're watching this, um, if you're getting into beer, if you're new to beer, um, basically what we're doing, we're grabbing that malt and then over here, look, it's being tipped down into the mash tun. It isn't a dark beer, so we we put all malts at one time. Okay. Uh, even the roasted barley. So this is a small quantity of roasted barley. It's uh, not more than uh, five kilos. So lovely. So if you're getting into beer, if you're new to beer, all fresh ingredients. Um, beer is good for you. You can see that. Look at that. You could have that for your breakfast. Do you feel this smell? Yeah, it smells fresh crushed malt. Sme fresh crushed malt. It's um, it makes you very hungry. <laughs> makes you very hungry. Okay. Okay, Zemek. Um, yeah. Next stage of the brew. What's happening here? Yeah. Uh, now we are mashing. Right. Okay. Uh, all malts uh, uh, were put here in this kettle, and now we mash all malts in the one kettle. Uh, it uh, will take us uh, around uh, two hours uh, and then we will uh, louder and uh, boil the Okay, so the, that malt we've seen just now is coming down this chute. Yeah. Like this. Yeah. Pop. Down this chute and yeah. if I could just slide by you and into here. And if you can see, I'll just clean the camera. We are being mixed around. The malt added to hot water. Temperature is uh, 66. 66 degrees. 67, yeah. And uh, we'll reach at the uh, optimal temperature. 67. 67 yeah. degrees. Here is, the, here is the indicator. Oh, there you go. Okay, Zemet, um, it's time to taste the all important word. Yeah. Um, this is the first stage, the first look at the beer. Nice and warm, nice and hot. Uh, Very sweet because it's unhopped now. Right. Currently unhopped. Okay, <laughs> let's, give it a, let's give it a taste. Going to the top. Really nice and sweet. Um, loads of sugars in here. Of course, them sugars are going to be turned into alcohol later on. but. On a cold winter's day, it's great to have a nice glass of wood. Nice glass of wood. So this is the first taste of the beer. The first look at the beer. Imperial Red Ale. Good? Oh, yeah, very good. Very rich. And uh, 
nice sweetness. Yeah. Fantastic. It's hop time. Yeah. It's hop time. Hey. Okay. What American hops have we got here going in the brew? Columbus. Columbus. Oh, let's get some of these. Show it to the camera. So, aroma hops and bittering hops. Yeah, yeah it's a dual purpose. Oh, get your nose in there. Great stuff. Great stuff. Nice and spicy. Nice and citrusy. You can almost, it's, it's like um, a spyglass into the future, into what your beer is going to taste like. But that just smells absolutely fantastic. Great stuff. In this we trust. In this we trust. Yeah. So how many, uh, let me put these back, we don't want to waste any. Um, how much of these hops are going into our beer oh today? Mosaic. Mosaic. Uh, it is, uh, is it two, two, four, four. Columbus is uh, mosaic, yes. Ten, Around 60 kilos for five packs. Wow, that's a lot of hops. That is a lot of hops. This beer is going to be stonking. We're going to carry on weighing out these hops. Um, and then we're going to carry on brewing. Okay, we're on a mass rest. Uh, we're sitting here having a little rest, having a break. And uh, fantastic hospitality in Poland. Look at this. This is absolutely wonderful. We have some uh, wild boar uh, sausage. Is that the right word, Thomas? Yes, yes. Wild, wild boar sausage and some nice bread. This bread is baked here in the restaurant. Oh, fantastic, fantastic. Okay. Mmm. No. No, it's uh, no, bread no. with oats. Oh, it's really tasty. Really good. And with some. It's angielskie śniadanie, English breakfast. Extra, English breakfast. Ex, extra special bitter from Pinta. So we got some sausage, some bread, wash it down with some beer. Perfect uh, uh, breakfast of uh, champions. <laughs> And while I'm on camera, camera um, how do you say um, fantastic in Polish? Wspaniałe, doskonałe. Uh, Wspaniałe, doskonałe. Doskonałe, fantastic. Uh, we have the owner here, she, she doesn't want to go on camera, but um, I just want to say thank you um, for, for, for the hospitality, the chance to brew here today. Uh, English breakfast. Brew a pinter. Cheers. Cheers. Do you want? Would you like to try some? Uh... Do you know where uh, that uh, these are sausage uh, with uh, wild? Mm. Wild boar. Yeah. Mm, really good. Really wild sexy. pig and mm. elk. Odważone, we'll do your recommendation. Zapraszamy na nieszczęście. Look at that. We got some hungry brewers coming in. Hungry brewers. Te krzesełka z laboratorium trzeba przynieść tu. Jeżeli mam chmielisto. Jutro razem laboratorium. Cheers. Nie, nie, poniedziałek. Okay, late addition of the hops, is it? Yes. Late addition. The moment. Look at this. And be careful. Okay, see? Oil and hops. Fantastic. So I take you in? Yeah. Amarillo, Columbus, and Mosaic. Amarillo, Columbus, and Mosaic hops. Yeah. Going into the brew. Big bag full of them. Fantastic. Jedna zamieszanka? Smells great. It's a glass of the wood, but it's got the hop addition in there, so we, we get an idea of um, of the hops that are in the beer and whether um, Zionist is happy with it. So so yeah, it's a chill at work. Uh, How do you find it? I expect that. I Excellent imperial Irish red ale with a mm. strong bitter, strong bitterness. But uh, I feel the full of aroma. 
Very aromatic. Yeah. Yeah, very aromatic. <coughs> I like that chocolate beginning. Yeah. There's chocolate, but then yeah. now big pulling bitterness on the back end. A sweet fight with bitterness. Yeah. Uh, nice balance. Yeah. Nice but I, but I then, expect nice balance. Now, now all these things uh, are mixed up together. Mm. And a nice, right on the back end there, a nice kind of pulling bitterness on the back of the, on the, back of the throat. Yeah, that's going to be a corker. That's going to be great when, uh, when that's finished brewing. Do you, is there any, did you, did you mention earlier about dry hopping? Uh, we will see after fermentation. Okay. How it uh, will taste and uh, we will decide. But so we are ready to put uh, uh, a good quantity of hops for dry hopping. Fantastic. So this is it. This is how a beer, a behind-the-scenes look of how a beer is kind of uh, from start to finish, how, how it uh, is progressed and how it's finished. Um, it's tasted and it's smelt and it's looked at right the way through the brewing process. Yeah. High five. <laughs>